Guys, hello and congratulations on, on the film, which of course is the first one from your company, Locksmith. So it's a big deal for everybody really, isn't it? Oh yes. <laughs> An animated film is always a big deal because it takes hundreds of people and years of your life to mm. make. It's literally an insane way to make a living. Yeah. <laughs> It should but just be so, called no pressure. No pressure, but so <laughs> yeah. joyful when it finally becomes something that reaches actual mm. audiences, kids and families. It's mm. brilliant. Yeah. Mm. And you're the new guys on the block, essentially, at a time where really when the film industry has actually been having a very tough time. Why did you decide to set up a new company now? And why is the time <laughs> right for a new animation company? Well, I... Um, <clears throat> I basically, you know, Pete and I, we're not quite new kids on the block in that we made a film like 10 years ago. So yeah. we're actually really the That's old long kids on the block. <laughs> um, yeah. And after making that film, which was out in LA, I came back to London and I just felt like, why has we never had, you know, high-end animation coming out of London in the UK in the same way? Because we have brilliant children's writers. We have the best literature. <laughs> we have amazing digital production companies. And, you know, I love the London creative community. So I set about trying to bring together people that could make, you know, fantastic uh, animation that would could compete with a Disney or Pixar. But in the end, honestly, it's incredibly difficult to compete with those companies in terms of their technology and their, their you know, their craft. But what you can do is make a fresh, authentic story. Mm. And so it's really important to me to make something that's about kids mm. and about parents and about all the things that we're going through that we know is true and tricky and complicated for us and then do it with and Disney. then is true for everybody <laughs> else you know it's a mm. universal theme isn't it friendship and technology talking about kids and families peter your background isn't quite that really is it because you worked on the likes yes. of Boras and alan partridge why did they yeah, yes, man why would they man. let me what in a, what, what was what was sarah through? thinking what was disney thinking let me anyone near an animated movie that's but kind of my question is, I, yes <laughs> yeah fundamentally i mean i've been doing you know i did arthur christmas with sarah like yeah. 10 years 10 years ago and i did hotel transylvania and i kind of always joke that like i I kind of, once I've done one of those other movies, I, uh, you know, to, to clear away the shame and put something wholesome in the world, I come back and I, the thing is, we've always been massive, we've known each other a very long time, we've been giant Pixar nerds from the beginning, and I always loved that, and in fact, when I speak with, when I work with someone like Sacha Baron Cohen, I bore him senseless about Pixar, oh, stop, stop it about Pixar, you know, like, because that's pure, wonderful storytelling. And I think, you know, for me as a director, why do you want to make movies for anything other than the people you care about most, which is your children and your family? So mm. I think it's the most fantastically gorgeous thing mm. to put something in the world that actually is for families. Mm. And Sarah, you, you mentioned Disney earlier and the film, of course, is being distributed by them, mm -hmm. but it didn't start out as being no. a Disney movie how excited were you when you realized that it was going to have the Disney name on it? Uh, I was absolutely terrified to start with. <laughs> yes. I mean, we had great relationships with the Fox team mm. who um, greenlit the movie and they're all great people. But so suddenly it's scary to be with new people. But also I remember having to go in and pitch what we were doing to the chairman of Disney I mean, you have to be a little bit brave and nervy to go in with animation and start pitching it to Disney. Uh, it was so slightly. <laughs> the expression Coles to Newcastle come into yeah. it there, you know. I was like, hello, uh, we're a little bit new, but uh, we do have animation. But you know what? They've been unbelievably Would you, would you like some animation? Would you like some Disney. more animation? Change. Change. Some, change. I don't know if you've got any at the moment. But they are. They have yeah. been amazingly supportive. They mm. really love the subject mm. of the film and they never made us feel like we were tiny new babies. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, very very good very yeah, lovely well guys i hope that um lots of families will go along and see it because i've i've already seen it and i've really enjoyed myself watching it so thank, thank you, you very much for your time it's been lovely to talk to you and, and you, you thank you thank, thank you. you so much